Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Yasin and welcome back to another episode of the best Android setups tutorial. I believe this one right here is episode three. Today we're going to be duplicating this amazing setup that I like to call Jupiter. It was the one that was voted for as the best setup from the best Android setups episode six. Right now, episode seven is out. You can check it out by clicking on the card right up here. Make sure you go check out that video and vote for your favorite setup in that video. And then that's the one I'll be duplicating in the next best Android setups tutorial. So in this video, it might be a little bit long because I had a few people reach out to me asking me to be a little bit more detailed when I show them the tutorial on how to set these Android setups. So we're gonna jump over to the desk and then I'm gonna try to be as detailed as I can, but once again, if you guys have questions, you can always leave them down below in the comment section. I'm always over there answering questions. Anyway, let's check out the setup. So this right here is my Galaxy S10 and I took everything off of it and this is what it looks like when it's stock right out the box. And I wanna show you guys every single thing that we are going to be doing to duplicate the setup. So the setup that we are duplicating is the Jupyter setup from the best Android setups episode six. And that setup consists of this Jupyter wallpaper. It's Nova launcher. It's got the icon packs, the lines icon pack, and it's rocking three widgets. The first widget is from the watermelon plugin for KWGT. The second widget is from the base plugin for the default KWGT. And the third widget is from the Andromeda for KWGT. So we are going to be downloading all of these things and setting this up. So everything that I just mentioned will be down below in the description of this video, but they are also in the description of the best Android setups episode six. And that is what I'm going to be referencing in this video. So I'm gonna start with the wallpaper and I'm gonna go to YouTube and I already have this video loaded and I'm just gonna go down to the description and go to that Jupyter setup. And in that Jupyter setup, I'm gonna start with the wallpaper by clicking on the link for the wallpaper. And then after that, this is the wallpaper right here. We can click on it and click download and then it's going to go ahead and download that wallpaper. Now, this is the way that I like to set up the wallpaper. I like to go to the gallery or Google Photos right here, whatever app that you use, but basically go into it and pull up the actual picture hit the three little dots at the top and say set as wallpaper. And then you wanna say set as home and lock screen or just the home screen, whatever you prefer. But I like to set it as the home and lock screen. It's going to give me a preview of exactly what it looks like. Then I'm going to say set wallpaper. Then I'm gonna go back home. And I like to do it that way because it centers the wallpaper. If you press and hold on the home screen and go to wallpaper, sometimes it will not center it. Right now it needs an update, but that's besides the point. So now that we have the wallpaper, let's go and download Nova Launcher. So you can go back to this video or you can just check out the description of this video. But basically we are going to click on Nova Launcher link. And when we click on the Nova Launcher link, it's going to show us the link. We're gonna say open in Play Store. It's gonna open it and we are gonna install Nova Launcher. While that's installing, we can go ahead and start also installing KWGT. And then I'm gonna also continue and install the Watermelon plugin for KWGT. Now I already know what is being used in this setup, that's why I'm just going ahead and typing them in and downloading them, but if you don't, you can just go to the video description or back to this video and each item that is used in the setup will be linked right here where you can click on it. But we also need to get the Andromeda and the lines icon pack. So I'm going to go back to the Play Store, get the Andromeda for KWGT, and then we are going to get the lines icon pack for the setup right here. Okay, so now that we have everything downloaded, what we need to do is download the backup file for Nova Launcher. So we're gonna swipe up and it's going to ask us, do you wanna go to the One UI or Nova Launcher? For now, let's just click on the One UI, go back to the video description or the description of this video, and then you wanna go to where it says Nova Launcher Backup, and you wanna click on that. I accidentally clicked on the wrong thing, but you wanna click on the Nova Launcher backup, and then it's gonna take you to the backup, and we are want to download this one right here, which is the Jupyter Nova backup, and then you wanna click download. It's gonna go ahead and download it, 
And once it's downloads, you can click swipe up to go home. And this time you can click Nova Launcher and you can say always, and it's gonna put you in Nova Launcher. And then it's gonna ask you, do you wanna start fresh or do you want to have a Nova backup? So that is why it's important to download the backup first before you launch Nova Launcher for the first time. So we're gonna click on Nova Backup, click Allow. Then you wanna click on Browse. And when you click on Browse, you wanna go into the Downloads folder and it's the backup right there. So far, we've only downloaded the wallpaper and the Jupyter Nova backup since this is a fresh new Galaxy phone. So you wanna click on that and then you wanna say apply. So once Nova Launcher resets itself, you wanna make sure that everything's starting to come together. You can see that there are placeholders for the top widget and the bottom widget, and the icon packs have reloaded with the lines icon pack. But if they didn't, one way to make sure the, the icon packs are the ones that you want is you can press and hold on the home screen, go into settings, and in the Nova Launcher settings, you wanna to go to look and feel, go to icon styles, click on the icon theme, and you just make sure that the one you downloaded is selected. So that's the lines free. If we go home, you'll see that everything looks like the lines free, but there might be a couple of apps that look a little bit different, and that's because those ones are not supported by this icon pack, but you could simply just change them or put other icons on your home screen, for instance, just click on this and remove it, click on this and remove it, and then you want to Go into the app drawer and find something that you use like Gmail, grab it, and then you can go ahead and put it there and then go back into the app drawer and then bring something else like Google Chrome right into the home screen. And now the icons all look uniform. So let's go ahead and set up the widget. So on the top widget, uh, let me check one more time, go into YouTube and see that it is the watermelon number 78. So if we click on that, then we go to this part where we can select the plugin for KWGT and it's the watermelon, which is the one we downloaded earlier. So if we click on it, it shows that this says pro and that we cannot use any of these unless we get the pro version. So not all the setups are gonna have things like pro versions for plugins for KWGT. Some of them have free ones, some of them have pro ones, but this particular setup that we're doing right now uses the pro version. So we are gonna go ahead and go into the Play Store and then download the pro version for KWGT. And if you don't wanna download the pro version for KWGT, then you could simply just go ahead and find another widget to put on there and make changes. Essentially, it's done the same way. You wanna just click on it, click on the plugin or find a free plugin and then go exactly to the number that you like. For instance, in this setup, it's number 78, which is this one right here. So we're gonna click on it, click save, go home and see how it shows up. It's still a little small, so we wanna make it a little bit bigger. So you wanna tap on it again, go into there and go to layers and just bump up the size little bit by little bit until you like the way it looks, click save, go home, and that's what the top widget looks like. And then we can click on the bottom widget once we find out from YouTube exactly what it was. And the next widget right here is going to be the Andromeda plugin widget 32. So we go back home, click on the placeholder, go into the Andromeda, and we are going to go to number 32. So this is it, number 32. You click on it once again, you will click save, go home. So that's the setup right here, that Jupyter setup. It looks really amazing and I love the way it came out. Basically all you need to do is download the wallpaper, the Nova Launcher backup, the KWGT and the KWGT plugins. Start with the wallpaper, then the Nova Launcher backup, and then go ahead and set up the widgets, making reference to the widgets that I'm going to list in the video description. And then the icon packs are very easy to set up. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely give it a thumbs up. I'm sorry if it was really long. I was trying to make sure that I got every single detail. If it's your first time to my channel, definitely consider subscribing. Thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Until then, stay plugged.